Hello everyone, Jane Borges here from Zen Within Me Homes, bringing you another beautiful new construction home here in sunny Spring Hill, Florida. Okay, now this home is 2389 square feet, five bedrooms, I believe it's two and a half baths, I'll have it there in the um, title. It has a loft and it's a two car garage. Okay, so I this is the model home, so I'm just standing inside the home. So this is what you see when you first come in. And as you can see, this is a two-story home. So those of you looking for a five-bedroom, two-story home, this is definitely the one for you. Okay, so before we go upstairs, actually, you know what? Let's go upstairs first. Okay, I'm gonna show you the foyer though. Okay, we have a half bath here, so I believe it is two and a half baths. So this is how, okay, the foyer looks. Let's go upstairs. You have a window here, just so you can see. Okay. All right. So you'll have carpeted stairs. This is the loft area. When you come up, I love those little controllers on the wall. Too cute. Now you can see this is a nice size couch. Okay, so here is the view from here. Okay. So I'm going to stand in this corner so you can actually see with this size couch, it's a nice size loft, plenty of room. Okay, window here. Still have room here in the corner for a couch or a chair, excuse me. Okay, now let's check out the rest of the home. Okay, so over here, we have a bedroom. I'm trying to give you the, an idea of the depth of the room. they turned it off by the switch that's okay okay now I'm in the corner of the room here now this is a full-size bed to give you an idea of the space here full-size bed standard closet in the other corner now so you can see from this angle the furniture that they have in here and everything Okay, and then you have a walk-in closet here. There we go. It's the depth there. Walk-in closet in bedroom one. Lots of room. Okay. Okay, going back out into the hall. So here to recap on the right, this is the loft and the way to go downstairs. And here it's just the, the unit behind that door, which, I mean, I could show you if you want, just so you see how it looks. That's where they put the unit. Okay, now we have the bathroom. Okay, so you get the depth here. Double sinks. Nice big mirror, my hand. <laughs> okay, there's no towel rack or closet behind here. It's just the bare wall so you can see. Okay, and then in here is where they have the tub and the toilet. No towel rack behind this door either. It's actually there. So you have shower tub combo. Okay. So this is tile, it's not bath fitter for those of you that are wondering. Okay. Okay, so coming out of the bathroom, there are three more bedrooms. 
So we have the first one here on the left that we already checked out, two, three, and four. Okay, so four bedrooms, a full bath, half bath downstairs, and then one in the master. So here's the size of this room. Full size bed again. This room's cute. Okay, now this does not have a walk-in closet. It has a standard closet, but still lots of space. Okay, so I'm gonna stand in the closet and show you from in the closet here. Okay. Okay, so we have two bedrooms, a full bath, bedroom three. Okay. Full size bed. Fan. Now this one has a walk-in closet. Okay. Now from in the closet, you can see the size of the room. So decent size, I mean, you fit a full size bed, you still have room to walk around, you have your dresser here, you know, a nightstand or whatever you like over there. And then if you wanna see like in this corner because of the way they move the bed, you, you have room to get out, you know, if there's two people sharing this bed. That's cute. <laughs> okay. So, going to the next bedroom. Let me see, there we go, you can get the idea. Okay. There we go. So this is a twin size bed, but this has that pull out mattress that goes up. I forgot what they call this bed. It's not a Murphy bed, that's the one that comes down from the wall. This, this is that other bed. So it, it can become a queen um, but right now they they have it as a twin, which is a great idea if you wanted to do this as a guest room slash whatever else room or a nursery, you know, and then the closet here is just the standard closet. So you have two bedrooms up here with two standard closets and then two with two walk-in closets. So from inside the closet, Here's the size of the room, okay? And then they have something over here so you can see the space. Lamp, give you a good idea from the window. To the walls! <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't help it. <laughs> okay, now there's a closet here in the hall. So this would be linen, towels, whatever you need for these bedrooms. Okay. All right. So that's what we got going on up here. So to recap, we have one, two, three, four bedrooms and a full bath. Okay. So everyone is going to be sharing this bathroom up here, but at least it's separate, the sink and the toilet and the shower. So people can be in here uh, simultaneously without disrupting each other. Okay. And then you have the loft lounge area, which, you know, for guests or kids, this is perfect. You know, they have their space upstairs and then you have your space downstairs. So we're going to go and check out the master now and the rest of the house. Okay, so here is the half bath. Okay, need the sink, toilet. Okay, coming out, we have here the dining area, living room, 
and kitchen. Sorry, some people just came into the model, so we apologize for the noise. <laughs> Here is the pantry. And the laundry area, that's the two-car garage over there. Okay, they left, so I can get back to the video. Okay, so we have the laundry area here, tiled. Okay, like I said, that's to the two-car garage, but right now they're using that as the office, so I'm not going to show you that. Let's check out the counters and the cabinets. Okay, so you do have granite countertops here. You do get all the appliances. Stainless steel, including the refrigerator. Let's take a look and see. Well, they have some stuff in here, which is perfect because then it gets, it gives you an idea of the size. Okay, now let's see the drawer. So you see the depth of the drawer, and then this comes all the way out like that. Okay. Check out the sinks. Double sink. Dining area from here. Living room area from here. I'm gonna show you the refrigerator because like I said, it is included and the cabinets so you can see from this angle lots of outlets living room area let me back up here and give you an idea from the kitchen very nice size and then you can see they have three stools here okay Sliding doors to the back. Now where this is available, you won't have this view in the back. This is just where the model sits, okay? Okay, now to the master. King size bed in here, okay? So this is a king size bed, and look how much space you still have. A king size bed, two nightstands. Okay, you get the fan, the window here on the right. I'm going to go in the corner by this nightstand so you can really see the size of this room. This is a very big room. Dresser, chair, and you still have all this room. Look at this. All this room. Lots of room. Let me show you from the bed there. See? Okay, now from inside the bathroom let me back up more so you can see from the door see how much space you have this is a nice size room okay now going into the bathroom you have a little vanity area there double sinks wall-to-wall -wall mirror here or side-to-side -side wall mirrors very nice Walk-in closet, toilet with a door, and then here you have towel rack inside the shower, and it is a stand-up shower. Okay. Now going to the walk-in closet, you have a side over here on the left when you first come in. This reminds me of a fitting room. <laughs> I see all that space. Okay, now from the corner of this closet to give you a better idea you still have all this space okay nice big walk-in closet all right so they are building this in several communities so if you are interested in this home this floor plan and you want it in spring hill or newport ritchie 
or wherever it is that you're looking to move to in Florida, I can help you anywhere. I specialize in new construction. If you didn't know, now you know. And uh, I can help you anywhere in Florida or any other states as a referral agent, okay? So my info is down below in the description box. Please contact me, fill out my registration form. It's just basically letting me know that you're not working with another realtor and you'd like to work with me. Um, let me know what you're looking for and I will contact you as soon as I get that email. All right, peace and love guys. See you soon.